do you think Nintendo is going to announce a new Zelda game at E3? What's up, YouTube? This is Hex from Not Too Nerdy. Welcome back to another weekly vlog. Now, let's go straight into what I did last week. Uh, last week, I did the first thing I did was talk about uh, different gaming news. I talked about the Xbox One, Watch Dogs, The Witcher 3. It's a really quick video, to just explain like all the different news that happened last week. There's a lot of different news, so uh, definitely go check out the video. You might uh, be informed of certain things, maybe things you didn't even know about. Um, after that, I did um, The Walking Dead. The Season 2, Episode 3. I did all the bad choices like I always do. Um, there's four parts to this. It's a pretty dark episode. So if you did not get a chance to see this and you want to check it out, definitely check it out. It's really a dark episode. Of course, I made it even worse with all the bad choices that I did. But, um, you know, it was good things, bad things. I wish I could control more of the action that happened in that episode. But overall... That there was a lot of action. It just, it just seemed like it was more of like the computer's doing it by itself and there's a lot of action to sit down and watch, but it was a good episode regardless. You know, I kind of wish I did more, but besides that, it was a really good episode. So definitely go check that out. After that, I did a product review for Skin It. Now, it's for the DualShock 4. I got this for free. If you guys remember a little bit, like when I did unbox it for the MLB 14 to show, I talked about how I got a free, uh, decal for the, the PlayStation 4 DualShock 4. And, um, you know, I actually gave you guys a chance to see what it was like. I did a little unboxing, showed you what it looks like on the DualShock 4. It's pretty damn cool, actually. So uh, definitely go check out that video. And that's pretty much it. That's all I did last week. Wasn't too much stuff. Now, for uh, next week, what you expect on this channel, I'm going to be, you know, once again, do, like, different gaming news throughout the week. Um, Wolfenstein comes out next week. So you'll definitely see some gameplay for Wolfenstein. And uh, that's pretty much it. I mean, I still have Stick It to the Man and stuff like that. Different, different like games that I did not get a chance to play yet. Because I've been playing MLB the Show, uh, you know, on Twitch. So if you haven't been seeing my live streams, definitely go check that out. It's a lot of fun. A lot of people have a lot of fun with it. See me get uh, screwed over in the game, but I am in the pros, so that's a good thing. It's just that the umpires and everyone just seems like they're against me. Even my teammates make errors on purpose. It's it's really bad, but. I'm back in the pros, so that's the good part, you know. But I'm having a lot of fun with that game, so definitely go check that out. And that's pretty much it. So let's go straight into the vlog topic for today. Now, the vlog topic for today is, do you think Nintendo is going to announce a new Zelda game at E3? Now, the reason why I ask you this is because Nintendo said that Pretty much they understand, you know, the Wii U isn't selling too well or anything, but they did mention that one game could uh, change the way a game sales go or something like that, you know? They said that pretty much it's all about one game. One game. Like, they're hinting like they're going to have one big game at E3. And I, I don't know. I think it might be a Zelda game. A lot of other people are speculating that too. I mean, is that the game they're talking about? Or maybe it's a Pokemon game. Like, what, what do you think would be the game that will actually help the Wii U sales? You know, I mean, obviously, the Wii U isn't going to be a great success, but is there a game that maybe will make people buy the Wii U for? Now, Mario Kart 8 and Smash Brothers are good games, you know, really, really good games. Even Mario, like, you know, Mario Kart is, you know, like everyone's saying great things about it. It got, like, a, it has ratings like 8s and 9s and stuff like that. Like, it's getting good ratings and stuff like that, but... I still don't think that's enough to save the Wii U just for that game alone or Smash Brothers. But if they have those games and then they they introduce like a game like Zelda, that might be, you know, a choice people like might make. They might be like, okay, I'll go get one. Why not? I think that's the whole reason why the Xbox One dropped in price. You know, they got rid of the Kinect because they realized that all these games are coming out for Wii U as well. And it's either going to be, oh, I'm going to buy a, you know, a new console like the PlayStation 4, or, well, I have, you know, some money lying around, let me go get a cheaper Wii U console. But now that the Xbox One's dropped the price, you know, they, they might have did that on purpose because they know that they're going to have some serious competition coming up soon. But, um, I'm kind of curious what you guys think. Do you think there'll be a Zelda game? Like, I have no idea, you know. I, I think that would be shocker if they did come out with a Zelda game. I, I don't, expect it because they've been saying it's coming out for a long time it hasn't come out and the way it sounds like it doesn't seem like it's gonna be too much longer for this wii u generation 
So if that's the case, then they might need to bring out a game like Zelda or even Pokemon. If you got Pokemon on the console, I think that might be something a lot of people will buy because you can't get a Pokemon game anywhere else. I mean, obviously you can't get a Zelda game anywhere else, but point is that Pokemon sold like a lot of the DSs back in the day. Then you know that that that's what sells the DS and 3DS. So I don't know. I'm kind of curious what you guys think about that. So in the comments down below, let me know what you think. It's going to happen at E3 for Nintendo. Do you think it's going to be the Zelda that's going to save Nintendo? Is that the game that they're, they're going to announce at E3? And that's pretty much it. So hopefully you guys are, uh, you know, following me on Twitter. You guys will like my Facebook fan page. And uh, definitely uh, subscribe to me in this channel if you're new to this channel. I do vlogs every week, every Sunday. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So this is Hector from Not Too Nerdy. I'm out. See you too.